thanks for watching my video today I'm going to uh, solve here cosine function is infinite product so in last time in last in my last video I've saw that sine theta is is equal to 2 to the k minus 1 sine theta by k sine pi plus theta by k and so on up to k minus 1 pi plus theta over k ok now in order to get uh, cosine so let's put theta is equal to pi by 2 plus theta therefore what we get is sine pi by 2 plus theta is equal to 2 to the k minus 1 sine if you put pi by 2 plus theta that means pi plus 2 theta over 2k and here is a sine if you put theta is pi over 2 plus theta that means 3 pi plus 2 theta over 2k and so on and this term will be sine 2k minus 1 pi plus 2 theta over 2k and now we know sine 90 plus that something angle is cos of that angle is equal to 2 to the k minus 1 sine same thing pi plus 2 theta over 2k sine 3 pi plus 2 theta over 2k and so on and last time will be this one 2k minus 1 pi plus 2 theta over 2k and now taking last term that means this term sine 2k minus 1 pi plus 2 theta over 2k and if you simplify this sine of pi minus pi minus 2 theta over 2k so sine 180 pi minus something is sine of this one pi minus 2 theta over 2k and uh, last time but one factor here they mean sine 2k minus 3 pi plus 2 theta over 2k is equal to sine pi minus 3 pi minus 2 theta over 2k this mean sine of pi minus this one mean sine of this one 3 pi minus 2 theta over 2k now it will go on now since if you see here last factor this is the last factor and this one same thing but they are conjugate here and this and this is last but one factor here and these are conjugate so taking that one so cos theta is 2 to the k minus 1 sine pi plus 2 theta over 2k and last factor is sine pi minus 2 theta over 2k let's combine this two and sine 3 pi plus 2 theta over 2k sine of 3 pi minus 2 theta over 2k and combining this and go on 
Okay. Now, what, are, what we are going to do is this one. Sine pi over 2k plus 2 theta over 2k. That means sine of a plus b, a plus b, sine of a minus b. And if you apply the formula, this is 2 to the k minus 1. This one is sine square pi by 2k minus sine square mm, 2 theta by 2k. And this also same formula, sine of a plus b, sine of a minus b. Which is sine square a minus sine square b and so on. And now taking the limit s theta tends to 0 so taking limit so this left hand side limit theta tends to 0 cos theta is just 1 and here if you take the limit okay then theta tends to 0 here is we on the left hand side we get 1 is equal to 2 to the k minus 1 and if you put theta is equal to 0 so when theta is 0 0 divided by this k mean in this 0 sine 0 is 0 so we left is sine square pi over 2k and here also sine square 3 pi over 2k and it will go on now let's divide this one Let's name this as 1, this as 2. Now let's divide 1 by 2. So cos theta by 1 mean cos theta. Let's go to this 2, we'll get cancer. And this and this will be 1 minus mm, this one. 1 minus sine square 2 theta over 2k divided by sine square pi over 2k this is 1 and 2 will be 1 minus this and this sine square 2 theta over 2k divided by sine square 3 pi over 2k and it will go on now when uh, now taking k as infinitely large number I mean k tends to infinity they mean theta over k will tends to zero okay now when limit theta tends to zero here if you simplify sine I can cancel to theta over k over sine pi over 2k whole I can write square this too. So if you simplify this, now if you put uh, theta is equal to zero here, okay. And if you if you uh, split this limit, what you are going to get is. So when k is very large, they mean uh, small number divided by large will be zero, approximately zero, and this also zero. Here k tends to infinity. Okay, not theta. Here k, k tends to infinity. Okay, this uh, we can apply all hospital rule. So all hospital rule mean k tends to infinity. All hospital rule for this is cos theta over k taking differentiation of this one into theta over k square divided by this also sine pi over 2k into pi over 2k square this whole square now 
this two can get cancelled now if you put that k equal to infinity i mean this one this denominator will be large when this is large and it will tends to zero so cos zero is one here also zero one so we'll get this theta square this one over two square min two square min here pi square over two square min four i can put here oh, upside here okay now let me do here and similarly if do if you do for this one that's right here limit k tends to infinity what is that sine square 3 theta by uh, 2 these two can get cancer to 2 sine square theta by k over sine 3 pi by what is that 2k Four square I can take now similarly if you take uh, if you do a hospital rule then mean you get this uh, theta square over 3 square pi square and this 2 square mean 4 can be coming out so this one ok now and other also now cos theta is equal to what 1 minus 1 minus and this whole term we know it is 4 theta square over pi square so which is 4 theta square over pi square this is 1 and this one 4 and uh, not not 4 1 minus 4 theta square over 3 square pi square and next will be let's say this 1 minus 4 theta square over 5 square pi square and so on so in short cos theta is represented as product form r equal to 1 to infinity 1 minus 4 theta square over 2 r minus 1 whole square Bye, Scott.